Allied victory at sea. The King has recently spent four days with the home fleet. He was received on board the flagship HMS King George V by Admiral Sir John Tovey, then concluding his appointment as Commander-in-Chief. It was a most powerful fleet that the King inspected, for in spite of very heavy losses, the Royal Navy has continued to grow in strength. One of the famous ships he visited was the light cruiser Scylla, which gained glory in the September convoy to Russia. Among new and powerful battleships inspected was HMS Howe, commanded by Captain Woodhouse, one of the victors of the Battle of the River Plate. The King went aboard many ships and many others that he had no time to visit were reviewed by him. What he saw was undoubtedly impressive. This was the fourth occasion since the war began that he has been with the fleet. Everyone knows, of course, what an unprecedented strain the Navy has had to bear, yet in the fourth year of war, the fleet itself is stronger and the fighting spirit of the fleet remains, as always, invincible.